Our incredible reunion. What if you knew you had a long lost sibling set out to find them and then discovered they lived just 15 minutes away? Well, that happened to two young men who were separated more than 20 years ago. They have reunited not just as brothers, but also as classmates. We are going to speak to those brothers in just a moment live. But first, take a look at their journey. Kieran Graham was just three months old when he was adopted by Tim and Sarah Graham. But as the years passed, Kieran beginning to wonder about his biological family. Eventually, his adoptive mother buying him an Ancestry DNA kit as an early Christmas gift. Through DNA testing, Kieran learned he had a likely brother, a 29-year-old named Vincent Gant. The two connecting via Facebook, Kieran writing, this is going to sound so wild, but I think you're my brother. Vincent replying, OMG, yes, you are my brother. Kieran learning that his birth mother put him up for adoption at three months in hopes of providing him a better life. The pair and their families meeting. The long lost brothers discovering that some things really are genetic. They attend the same university, have the same major and minor, and are even fans of the same football team, the Atlanta Falcons. On Sunday, Kieran tweeting, watching the Falcons game with my biological brother for the first time, every little thing is cool. And look who we have here, Vincent and Kieran. Good morning. Thanks for being with us. Kieran, your reaction finding out that your long lost brother just 15 minutes away. Uh, I was super <laughs> surprised. I was amazed. Um, I didn't know what to think at first. I just had so many emotions running through my head. Um, I was just super excited to finally get to see what he looked like, talk to him on Facebook and everything. So and know that you could visit at any time yeah. because you all were so close. Yeah, and, exactly. and Vincent, I can't imagine your reaction when you get this, this message on Facebook saying, hey, I think you might be my brother. Oh yeah, I was in disbelief and it was a very surreal moment. And it, and it took a while for me to set in. And you know, as the conversation progressed, it finally hit me, this is really my brother. Aww. And it was amazing. That, it, 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 I, it's such a beautiful thing to see the two of you together. Karen, what, what was it about now, this point in your life, that made you want to find your biological family? So I'd always been interested in getting to know them. You know, growing up, my parents were always very open with, um, you know, my adoption and everything. And so a few weeks ago, my mother, my adopted mom, she bought me a DNA test kit from Ancestry. And last Tuesday, I got the results. And, you know, I was just looking through, and I saw, I recognized his name, and I looked him up on Facebook. And there he was. And I was just like, wow, finally, after, you know, 20 years of, you know, thinking about it, there he was. It's I just, just got chills. Yeah. When, you, when you saw each other, was there recognition in, oh, on, on a certainly. DNA level, yes. basically? For sure, yeah. Wow. Yeah, it was like looking at a mirror when we first met. Yeah, you know, I can just definitely see the mirror. resemblance. <laughs> and Vincent, you were nearly nine, yes. right, when Kieran was born. Do you have memories of him as a baby? Almost certainly. I would say my vivid memory is seeing a baby smile for the first time, and it was his smile, my Aww. brother. And, you know, um, you know, more memories that I had was, you know, helping my mom take care of him because she was a single parent at the time, and then we didn't have much support. So I remember, you know, making bottles and helping my mom change the diapers and, you know, playing with him a lot. You know, so it Aww. was a great experience. And so when you all first met again, because you obviously had met at one point, you mm -hmm. don't remember, you do, Vincent. Yep. What, what was your initial reaction? Was it just, uh, was there any awkwardness? Was there just love? Was there a connection? You know, like, um, I saw him walking up to me, and he, he called my name, and we just stared at each other for like 10 or 15 seconds, like, <laughs> this is real. And then, you know, we approached each other and gave each other a hug and just, like, probably shed a few tears, you know, walked inside to a local place and just talked for a few hours. It was just... It was amazing, yeah. What's, what's also amazing is that you both are, is it Kennesaw State? Yes, Kennesaw You're State. You're both at the same college, and I mean, I'm, I'm, I hail from Georgia. There are a lot of universities you could go to. The fact that you guys are both at the mm -hmm. same college, you have the same major and the same minor? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What are you majoring and minoring? And that's pretty remarkable. Uh, political science and legal studies. Yep. Wow. And when yes, did you guys figure out you had all of these similarities? Probably our first conversation. Yeah. We were just Maybe talking one. about everything, talking about life, and that came up, you know, obviously. So we were just like, wow, we're the same person. I mean, it's yeah. crazy. <laughs> yeah. And you both like the Atlanta Falcons, huh? Love the Atlanta Falcons, fans. yes. Yeah. Please tell me you're going to root for, uh, root for the Georgia Bulldogs, though, come in the Rose Bowl, right? Of course, come yeah. On. Definitely. I'm from Definitely. the University of Georgia. We Georgia people have to stick together, oh, right? Oh, I would love yeah. to see Georgia get one. Yes. All right, good. I'd like to hear that. We need everyone rooting for us. So what's next for you two? Uh, just, you know, getting to know each other more, uh, right. you know, talking about life, you know, experiencing things that we haven't got a chance to experience for the last 20 years. Oh, yeah, just creating a stronger bond and, you know, mm -hmm. you know, taking this relationship to the next level, let it blossom to something bigger, you know, our 
families have become huge because of this now. Yeah. Yes. And so, you know, last week, you know, we kind of been inseparable. So I've probably seen them nearly every day. Yeah. Oh, and it's just so great. You're so close and there's just more people to love. Oh, yeah. What an incredible Christmas Certainly. gift. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. you. We wish you the very best. Thank you for sharing your story, guys. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.